welcome to Landria Anka on YouTube, here to help you break through those fears and live an awesome life. I want to talk today about the power of a journal. All right, so I have journals. Um, great, I don't have I don't have my special journal sitting down here with me right now, but journals hold power. Everything is an energy. When you place thoughts and feelings uh, onto paper, there is real energy in that. In fact. People have had the ability to, um, I believe Edgar Casey was one of those, to actually sleep on a book and absorb it, all right? Why? The words had energy. He could actually absorb that. We all have that capability. Well, his was natural. Who knows who he was in his last lifetimes, but he had amazing abilities. Well, you have those abilities too. So what we want to do with our journals is to get very clear on what it is we desire. So what what does that mean? What's cl clarity? Is that we know if we're feeling and thinking something that is of a negative nature, a lower frequency, we want to change that, right? So we have to sit with it and say, what is it I truly desire? What do I truly desire? And that's what your journal's going to hold, what you truly desire. Now, a lot of people use journals to you know spew out everything. I don't do that. I don't write my thoughts and feelings in my journal because I believe that, that those are statements. Now, if you're taking one of my e-courses, we do actually journal those because we're going to clear them out, and we actually, at the end, we dissolve them. All right, so we use that as part of our learning journal versus a journal of what I am. So I do have, I do have, and I'll put the link down in the description, um, I do have a journal called I Am. It's $9.95, and you can order it on Amazon, or you can go to LandriAnka.com. And it's only like, I think it's like 80 pages. But on, on each page, you know, uh, on some of the pages, I put like statements of what I am and, and that, you know, these things I know are true. And then, you know, and I give you prompts for, for you to start saying what you know you can be as, as a probability, and then you claim I am that. So I would like you to consider having a journal with the power of I am in it, whether it's my journal or you create your own. When you claim I am and you write those words in a journal and then you read them every day, it becomes really powerful because you're really reprogramming yourself to, to start to live the actual probability that you desire that you've written down. You know it's a probability. You know it exists right now, and it's in your uh, journal. And so when you read it, you're claiming I am that. So when you're, going, when you're journaling that, you know, I'm worried about this and that, and then you're still just fueling that stuff. We want to get away from that. The more you focus on the negativity, the more you create it. But you can transform anything you desire. So we want to transform everything. We want to say, what am I going to do with this? How do, be, how do I become powerful? You know, how do I become that amazing person because of this challenge that I had in my life or challenges? So journal what, how you're going to use things to empower yourself. Get clarity on what's really true, and that is you have absolutely limitless powers to change anything. And I know you guys want to believe this, and I know that very few of you on this channel do believe it, and that you know it's true, and that somehow you haven't broken through that human veil and barrier that has told us for centuries that we're not powerful, that we can't do these things. And how many people and prophets have come to this planet and told us and and shown otherwise, demonstrated, physically demonstrated, that they can manipulate this material world to do anything. Say mountain, it will move, and it shall move. No, the mountain doesn't go. You shift into a new reality where that mountain's someplace else. It's where you, you're going to. So all of a sudden, your reality has shifted. So when you say, you know, I am you know, enlightened, or I am abundant, or I am whatever, and you truly are in that space, not, oh, I'm going to say it 20 times, or I'll, I'll write it 100 times, it's going to happen. Go into that space. You have to go into that true faith. Write it in your journal. Put those powerful words in there, and doggone it, you believe it. Believe it, and you will actually shift in the reality where that exists, and you are it. 
And everything you'll do in your life is going to create that. It's going to draw it in. That money will be in your bank account. Checks will show up. And no, we don't have to have everything's on our timeline. That's the ego talking again. So journaling should be powerful. It should always be of a positive nature. And then you're working through things to say, you know, okay, so I am this. So then you start to every day act as you are that person. You read that every day. And then as your goals change, you can write new ones. I look and I'm like, oh my gosh, I've achieved every one of my goals. So I set higher goals. Everything's about expansion. So use that journal. It's so important uh, for you to do that because it really drives it home. Get clarity. Use it as a powerful tool. It has energy. Read it. Feel it. Know it. And when you feel powerful, you write more amazing things in there. You're whole, perfect, strong, powerful, loving, harmonious, and happy. Blessings to you, my friend. Namaste.